Hello food hunters, this is Tony. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm doing a review of a recent dinner I had at A Fiori, which is a one-star Michelin restaurant in uh, Midtown Manhattan. It's located at 400 Fifth Avenue in New York. It's on the second floor of the Langham Hotel. Uh, beautiful space, beautiful dining room. We got a wonderful table. Um, service, it is a one-star Michelin uh, restaurant. Um, service was kind of funny because everyone was really friendly. The Sameli is great there. Um, they were really friendly, but it seemed like um, the service was a little bit off. It was a little slow. Um, it, we couldn't really find some people at kind of key times. So, and um, it, sometimes they got some orders mixed up. Um, the menu is mixed up, so it's a little mishmash. Although the staff themselves are great, the atmosphere and they're very friendly. It was just it seemed like they were a little off their game on this night. So we'll give them the benefit of the doubt. So anyways, we had all um, the fixed price menu, which is a four course fixed price menu for one hundred and fifteen dollars. You choose one um, antipasto, one pasta risotto, one entree, and one dolce or sweet. This was my um, starter which is the um, lobster soup uh, with Perigold black truffle and crouton. This is the Valuetta. And you'll see this is the first photo and then they come in, this is the actual um, uh, kind of contents of the soup and then they pour the soup in afterwards, which is the next photo. I would recommend going with a price fix. If you think about it, $115 for four courses in downtown Manhattan with a one-star Michelin uh, restaurant is quite a, an affordable deal. So this is once they pour in the soup, um, this is their the uh, lobster soup. Um, good, and I'd say that for most of the dishes, again, uh, very similar to Chuang, my experience at Chuame. They had some great dishes, had some okay dishes, and so, um, kind of very similar I put it on the same level as Swami and but I enjoyed my experience at Vestry a little bit more this is another one of the antipasti dishes which is polipo which is octopus a la piestra chickpea uh, panisse fennel and gremolata um, nice again well plated dish um, I thought it was actually quite tender the octopus so I quite enjoyed this dish I had a bite from my friend and so um, I like this dish Next are the pasta dishes, and these are the two really special pasta dishes that um, really uh, our waiter told us was responsible for their Michelin stars. So the first one is spaghetti, and I love this dish. It's uh, with blue crab, lemon, bottega, uh, calabrian, chilies. Um, wonderful dish, handmade pasta. I really uh, enjoyed this dish, and uh, this was one of the uh, highlights of the night. The other dish was um, this trophy Nero, which is uh, Ligurian crustacean ragu, scallops, sepia, and spice malika, kind of like their squid uh, ink pasta dish. Um, didn't enjoy this as much. I know they've got um, a lot of texture in this dish, but I actually didn't like the crunchiness of it. It felt a little awkward, uh, so I didn't like this as, as much as the spaghetti dish. This was another one of their signature dishes. This is the entree. This is the ostisi, which is butter poached Novo, no, Nova Scotia lobster, Swiss chard, poppet de mano, develop, and basil. Um, beautiful plated dish. Spectacular. Um, lobster was cooked just um, right in terms of it was um, not overcooked. Um, dish was okay unfortunately this, I'm, I'm sorry to be um, critical it was not bad it was I wasn't exceptional but again the plating was just beautiful and then for dessert the, this is their meal fill which is um, chicory coffee ganache puff pastry macadamia and chocolate gelato gelato um, again exceptionally plated dish um, the taste was decent it was okay so all in all our experience was very good uh, i would still recommend this restaurant beautiful setting the staff are very friendly i think they had a bit of an off night in terms of service standard um it seemed like they were a little bit frazzled and um, maybe not a little short staffed the food quality was again reminding me of tuame good there was uh, there was no bad dishes it was just they were not 
not every dish was a stellar dish. There were some decent ones and there are some great dishes. Um, so again, uh, if you look at my video from Vestry, Vestry, I thought almost every dish was stunning and we really enjoyed everything. Um, and so either Vestry is a one star Michelin and these guys are kind of maybe miss the mark a little bit or these guys are ones you know Tuame and and this restaurant are one star Michelins and um Vestry should be a two star Michelin but anyways still enjoy the experience here hope you've enjoyed this video please like subscribe and keep watching till next time happy eating